have gone, the pain has worn, but the feeling's in the air. Hey, how come my Mikia smells so funny, ah? Huh? It's not your Mikia. Someone's got a hot date, I see. What's wrong? I already showered, what? Yeah, showered in cologne. Yeah. Hey, it smells like the air freshener that I use at work. Yeah. <laughs> hey, I'm in NS. I'm on a budget. Yeah. Next time, just use less. <laughs> Never mind. By the time you miss your way tonight, you have fit it off. Tonight? I'm having breakfast with her at TCH. No, she wants to see me all the time. The minute I'm awake, just before I sleep. Hey, how come I don't recall her to be so on about meeting you? Huh? Yeah, didn't you used to complain that she didn't want to contact you when you were in BMT? Mm-hmm. Mm hmm? Hmm? What? Don't remember. Okay. Anyway, who wants to help me prepare a romantic breakfast? Bye-bye. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Ma. You're the best. No, I'm just the slowest. <laughs> Ma, you're gonna help me, right? Pa, you really fired Jared? I gave him so many chances. And with this Mrs. Chia issue that is ongoing, I need someone who can be on top of things. You made the right decision. But I'm not sure how you're going to manage with no one. Yeah, I called Rachel. Your former assistant. She has agreed to come back for a few days to help me out. Wow, that's great. I like Rachel. Yeah, and she knows how we work, yeah. so she gets things done quickly. Exactly. That's the person I need. Uh, I'll go with you. More hands make light work. Why not? I need all the help I can get. Hey, Xiaowei. Good morning, Auntie. Hey, Xiaowei. Hey. Eddie, where is tonight? What? What's the occasion? It's my sister's wedding. Do you forget? No. Okay, so my parents and I will swing by to pick you up tonight. Make sure you look nice and take a bath. Buy better smelling cologne for Eddie. And don't spill any food on the tarts, okay? Bye. Hey. What about breakfast? So, one coffee. Yeah, thanks. Hey. Hi, Vasca. Hi, Lira. Hi. Um, two set of breakfast. Of course. Vasker, why can't we meet Rachel at the clinic? No, I wanted to pick up some food for later. We'll be working through lunch. Anyway, Rachel said she'll be having breakfast here. Might as well meet her here then. Dr. B! Rachel. Wow, are you... You look great. Thank you. So do you. <laughs> Please. Good to see you again, Rachel. You too. You, you look well, Mrs. Basker. Thank you. I am. I've read about the medical investigations in the newspapers. It must have been so stressful. Yeah. But it's not over yet, unfortunately. Well, whatever I can do to help Dr. B. Yeah, I know. Still needs work. This organic flower is just throwing me off. This helps. Much better. Mm. Okay, so anyway, I'm updating the Help Is Here contract and um, terminating it early will now carry a penalty. Do you want to prorate it? 
Hmm, that might be fairer. Mm. Hello, Miss Dunn. I see. Yeah, uh, it's okay, I understand. Okay, All right, bye. Another cancel contract? It's the third one since Friday. Time has already pushed three clients from me. Why didn't I put this in earlier? Well, you've always run your business with a lot of trust. It's not a bad thing. Hello, not a bad thing. Okay, you wanted someone supportive, right? Hana hana. Rachel, I thought you were working for that big clinic chain. Yeah, he's gone. She's left. Why do you think I thought of calling her back? I hated working for them. It was all about the money. How we can move patients quickly through the system. I told you before, Rachel. You're not suited for the kind of a place. I should have listened to you, Dr. B. You know me best. Look at this, so funny. <laughs> Give me a minute. Okay. Pam, you okay? Yeah. Sure? You wanna join us? Nah, it's fine. Sure? You don't seem so good. You know, this is such a waste of time. What is a waste of time? Uni? I could be working, making money. You mean you still wanna steal more of Diana's clients? Look, <laughs> Shruti, I've told you this is not personal. This is just business. May the person with the best pricing win. I don't know how you can do this to someone who helped you. You cannot understand because you've never had to struggle. You know what? You're right. And I'm sorry I even tried to understand. Uh, Madam Lin B. Gyok. This one goes in that file. Oh, thanks. And this one... Hang on. Into that stuff. You're amazing, Rachel. And uh, Lawrence Wong? Lawrence Wong, one, two, or three. One is bald, two has a golden tooth, and uh, three... Actually, there's nothing about three I can remember. <laughs> Mira, you're getting in the way. Come on. Yeah, uh, this is done. Okay. Yeah, this is done. Guys, I prepared an unpop for Xiao Wei's sister's wedding. Do you think I need to get her parents something too? What? You think the parents are ready? Yeah, her sister's wedding some more. Wah. Sounds way too serious, bro. Why? What do you mean? You're meeting the parents at a wedding. That's practically saying you want to marry the daughter. But Xiao Wei asked me to go. She's trapping you. I wonder why though. You've got no looks. No money. <laughs> hey, I'm still here, okay? Unless they're rich. Oi, how much you put in the number? Uh, 50? 50! Hey, I've been with some of these ladies who just love branded things. 50 bucks ain't gonna cut in, man. Ayah, uh, Xiaowei is not that kind. Did she pick out a suit for you? Tell you exactly what to wear. I'm sure she did, right? So? I can wear whatever I want. Are you sure? Yeah. I can. Ten bucks says you're chicken out. Call me in. Me too. Yeah. Be ready to pay me. Mira. You missed this. Oh, I'm sorry. You should go here. I'll be more careful. Take more time if you need to. I know you're not as familiar with the system as Rachel is, okay? The next time she came. Hi, Joel. Mira, uh, I need your help urgently. What happened? There's been an accident at a construction site. I need you to cover for me in the office. Uh, okay, I'll be right there. Uh, Basker. Yeah? It's Joel. Uh, he needs my. Joel again? Now? It's an emergency. Well, if it's an emergency, how can I say no? Mrs. 
Mrs. Lockman, I'm here to try to persuade you to sign a new contract with Hapus here. I understand that you recently terminated your contract, but... I'm actually glad you're here. You are? I regret hiring Pam. She's always doing such a rushed job. She's not thorough. Yes, I will sign your contract. Uh, in that case, uh, this is the contract and I've added in a new clause right here. Uh, it's just to protect myself and the company um, from poachers like Pam. You should have added this into your contract the first time. You're too trusting. I'm learning my lesson, Mrs. Lachman. All right. So are you guys enjoying orientation right now? Yes! Yeah. All right, good. We hope you guys are, but just in case you're not, warning, this next part might kind of suck. It's gonna be... <laughs> Bird House is excited. All right, so you guys are gonna get pet from different groups. That's right, one member from our group will pair with one member from Bird House's group. Uh, first up, Nicholas. There you go. Nicholas, come over here. You're gonna get pet with Weepin. And then, uh, Angie, you're checking your name tag. Come over here. All right, Angie, you are with Nicole and uh, Shruti. Shruti, Shruti gonna be with Pam, uh, Irfan. Over there. Irfan, you're with Dennis. And Siu Hui. Siu Hui with Maya. Irwan. Okay, and uh, you're with Kid. And finally, uh, Nora and Natasha. All right, guys, are we all paired up? Yeah. Yeah? All right, so this is a scavenger hunt. I hope you guys like it. Uh, just so you know, these pages we gave you are the clues for your scavenger hunt. And I have given you guys 45 minutes to complete the treasure hunt. That's right. Are you guys ready? Yeah. You don't look ready, Irfan. I am ready. Okay, Irfan. Go! <laughs> hey. Oh, I know this place. Where? Hey, where are you going? We're supposed to do this together. Why don't you start on the second clue? You're such a horrible person. Pam, wait! Oh, oh stuck in traffic. <laughs> Mira, finally. Uh, I'm going to go and check on the workers. I need you to start on the paperwork for the insurance claim. The paperwork? Uh, oh, oh, yeah, yes. I thought you... Um, I know, I was just flustered. You know, this is a full-time position. I'm not sure this part-time thing is working out. Joel, I'm ready for full-time. Right, we'll talk about this later. Okay. Yeah, there was a similar case at Eastcon Medical. Oh. Thank you. Thank you. Dr. Ku, senior doctor. Been there nearly 20 years. The medical board found him negligent and Iskon fired him. But your case is very different. Is it? Well, you're a very different doctor. I'll tell the medical board what a caring and wonderful doctor you are. Thank you, Rachel. But being caring has nothing to do with negligence. Hi, Diana. Hey, Xiaowei. Uh, hello, Auntie. Hello, Uncle. Ni hao. You must be Eddie. Yeah. Nice to meet you, sir. Oh, <laughs> Auntie, these are my parents. Oh, congratulations on your daughter's marriage. Thank you. <laughs> thank you, thank you. What are you wearing? Huh? What's wrong? Oh, you mean this? This is my favourite tie. See? It's the same colour as your father's. <laughs> you can't be wearing that. Why? Mommy, Auntie Lian actually owns this cafe. Ah, <laughs> oh, yes. A belly catcher place, ah. Huh? Oh, my son Chris designed the alfresco area. Would you like to take a look? Ah, uh, yes, go and have a look. Ed Eddie will be done soon and then we can leave. Yeah, let's go. Mostly her blog is about makeup and silly things. Are you sure you never heard of her? She even complained about her boyfriend. Mm. Oh, that Fufu Shu. You mean Sean is dating her? How embarrassing. <laughs> yeah. Does it make the two of you feel good? Gossiping and spreading rumors about someone you know nothing about? <laughs> and what a nice eye roll technique there, Angie. It's Angie, right? I'm sure I'll get an A for that. What? Why are you still standing here? Scavengers hunt. Hey. 
if you don't continue the scavenger hunt. No, it's fine. Let's carry on. I already bought you the tux. Why can't you just wear it? But what's wrong with this? Do you want my sister to laugh at you? No. If she laughs at you, that means she's laughing at me. No, it just means that she's laughing at me. Please, everything I have is not as good as us. Just do as I say. Okay, okay, okay. Don't be so rough. You're not fast enough. I don't want to be late for the wedding. <clears throat> I'm sorry to hear about the case against you. You heard? You are a good doctor and people in the neighbourhood are concerned about you, but I'm sure it'll be fine. I'm not so sure, Lian. In all my years of medical practice, I've never had a black mark against me. I don't know how I can help. You've helped by listening, Lian. Thank you. Ready to go, Dr. B? Oh, yeah. Um, I won't be needing this anymore, so I came here to return this. Well, that's one decent thing that you've done. Look, Diana, I'm a poor student. I need the money to pay for my university fees. I know. That's why you got the raise that no one else got. I know what it feels like to not have enough money. Why do you think I gave up uni? Uh, well, uh... You have so many clients. You can afford to lose a few. And who gave you that right to decide if it's okay for me to lose a few? You didn't work for this. I built my company up from scratch. So I'm going to win all those clients that you took from me back. But unlike you, I'm going to do it the right way. Ma? Hey. Adi, uncle. Thanks for inviting me for the wedding dinner. You're welcome. Auntie Lian, sorry for disturbing you this late. <laughs> oh, oh yeah, please take a seat. Come, make yourself at home. Hello. This guy here is my brother, Chris. And that's my big brother, Ben. Hi. Hello. Hello, hi. I will get everyone a drink. No, no, please. We only just had dinner. I will join you. Your son is very polite. He's such a good boy. A very nice, considerate boyfriend. Mmm. Very handsome. You must be very proud of your son. He has his moments. But I'm always proud of you. My elder daughter always teased your way that she cannot find your boyfriend. Ma, stop embarrassing me. Well, that's the same worry we have with Eddie too. <laughs> yeah, worry can't find a boyfriend. Yeah. Girlfriend. <laughs> no, girlfriend. Girlfriend. Yeah. Girlfriend. Yeah. Uh, auntie, uncle, I think you all should go back and rest. You need at least eight hours of sleep. And do come by and try our food one day. We will. Sure, we Thank will. you. It was nice meeting you. <laughs> you too. Thank you. Okay, bye-bye. Bye. Eddie, auntie, we go back first. Thank you. Bye. Bye. That's the last lot. Let's call it a day, Rachel. And thanks for staying back so late. Glad to be of help, Dr. B. Um, Rachel. Yes? It's already late. Let me pay for your taxi home, okay? Please. Thank you. I'll look up. I'll see you tomorrow, Doctor. Sure. Bye.
She trusted you to write this. Does she know how many marks you got for this essay? Hey, you're supposed to say something nice to make me feel better. Can you see how how hurt and heartbroken I am? Oh please. I was used. To crying on the inside. Eddie, you were using her as well. No. What? No. Remember your pre NS bucket list? You wanted a girlfriend just to get through BMT. Yeah, uh, but, but Eddie, it's the same thing. Okay.